I'm on vacation every single day cuz I love my occupation hey hey I'm on vacation if you don't like your life then you should go and change it hey hey I'm on vacation every single day cuz I love my occupation hey hey I'm on vacation every single day every every single day I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands. One nation under God, indivisible, indivisible with liberty and justice for all. Hi, Jess. I'm Kaylee Hicks. And I'm Jolie Ballard. And this is your daily dose for Tuesday, October 10th, 2017. The freshmen have had some time to settle in and just to high school life. How is it different from middle school? Hey RHS, do you remember your freshman year? We went around asking the class of 2021 how they feel about being in high school. Do you plan on participating in any sports this year? Yeah. Which ones? Um, baseball and basketball. What are you looking forward to most about your freshman year? I'm um, going to the football games and I'm standing in the student section. How do you feel about having a lunch shared with upperclassmen? Um, it's the same to me. I usually just sit with my friends like um, last year. Do you enjoy all the freedoms you have, such as being able to use your cell phone? Uh, yeah, I like listening to my music while I do my work. Sports one. Do you plan on participating in any sports this year? Yeah, I would like to do baseball. Yeah. What are you looking forward to most about your freshman year? I want to get good grades so I can pass all my classes and do good. How do you feel about having a lunch shared with upperclassmen? Well, it feels great. I have a lot of friends that are are at my lunch table that are seniors and sophomores. How do you like the post and hot spot compared to the snack line at Wilson? It's very, it's an upgrade, it's an upgrade. What do you think is going to be your biggest challenge transitioning from middle school to high school? How there's so many different floors and buildings. There you have it, RHS. Make sure to give the class of 2021 a good welcome. Now back to the anchors. Thanks, Haley. Freshmen still looking to get involved in activities at RHS Link Crew is hosting a freshman football tailgate this Thursday, October 12th. We'll be meeting at 3 p.m. near the concessions. The event will be for freshmen only. Activities will include a cornhole tournament, tug of war during halftime, donut eating contest, junior senior link leaders wearing freshman jerseys, food, drinks, music, and prizes. Attention artists, if you are interested in painting a mural, Miss Styles is now accepting ideas to add on to the existing murals by the loading dot. Ideas are due by October 31st. Also, Mrs. Stiles is starting a new chapter of the National Art Honor Society here at RHS. They will be meeting the same time as Art Club, Thursdays from 3 to 4 in the Art Room. Girls Group will be holding their first annual ice cream social tomorrow, October 11th, after school in the Teacher's Lounge. See Ms. Sucka for additional information. Do you excel in science, social studies, and literature? Does the arts, sports, and current events interest you? If, you, if so, join the Quiz Bowl team and test your knowledge against other high school teams. Practices start tomorrow in room B113. All are welcome to try it out. See Ms. Mr. Curtis for more information. The Gay Straight Alliance is meeting after school on Wednesday, October 11th in Ms. Mr. Keith's room. New members are always welcome. Attention seniors, upcoming college visits this week include... University of Detroit Mercy today during 6th hour, U of M Ann Arbor tomorrow during 3rd hour, and Schoolcraft College Thursday during 7th hour. See Mr. Ms. Morris and the CRC to sign up. Attention students, SAD is looking for new members. They meet every other Wednesday in Ms. Barber's classroom, A318. Their first meeting will be this Wednesday. Gamers Club meets today in room A178B right across from the auditorium. And Key Club will be meeting today after school in the LMC. If you're interested in community services and helping others, come check us out and see what we're all about. All are welcome. Now let's go to Keyshawn with your daily sports report. I'm Keyshawn, this is your sports report. Tennis has their down for leading me today. More on that tomorrow. Freshman football beat New Boston Heron. JV football won over Southgate 24-0. Varsity football won big 45-6 over Southgate for big performances from Riley Stewart, Chance Sunday, Don Nicolaio, and Chris Munoz. That's all for your sports report. Now back to the anchors. Thanks, Keyshawn. Anyone interested in playing winter tennis at the Monroe YMCA, please see Mr. Haley in room A345. Happy birthday to Haley Deal, Michael Dumbersky, Tegan Josephite, Harley Laughlin, and Jordan Terrence. 
This year, we will feature some in-depth pieces that cannot fit into our daily dose time frame. They will be uploaded to YouTube to see in full. Today, we will air a piece of Mr. Haley's AP U.S. History class. First class makes everything a little more difficult, and a lot of the things we do in A-Push require small groups. What was it like walking in on the first day to such a large class of people? Um, it was overwhelming. Uh, overwhelming. Not, well, sort of. Well, I mean, it was very surprising. When I walked in, I was with Jobo and Jack, and we walked in and we were like, whoa. Number one, it's hot, and number two, there's a lot of bodies in here. But I expected it from last year's AP uh, government classes that a lot of people were going to be taking April, so I expected it. I knew that the class was going to be large, but the desks were set up in such an odd way. Like, it's not easy to focus when you're facing the wall and the teacher's talking in the front. I don't know, it's weird body angles. It's just a weird experience. Go to rhsbearedaily.com to see the full piece. Remember, this month's virtue is courage, and as Ambrose Redmond said, courage is not the absence of fear, but rather the judgment that something else is more important than fear.